Inquisitor. What happened here? The House of Repose decided to pay a visit. The guards arrived in time, but I should have guessed the assassins would infiltrate the servants. Are you sure they didn't hurt you? They only frightened me. It was all so sudden. Leliana assigned people to shadow me. They appear to have saved my life. I owe you everything, Sergeant. Only my duty, Ambassador. I'll talk with the spy master about these murderous louts. She'll find how they got in. Thank you for seeing me in private, Minister Belize. I chastise you for taking me from the party, Inquisitor, but the Marquis throws such dull affairs, it's hardly worth it. I assume you wish to discuss your petition to elevate these du paraquettes to a minor lordship. Tell me, why should I allow you to pollute the Orlesian nobility any further than it's already been muddled? You don't think much of the current Orlesian nobility? I do not. It is a watered-down shadow of its former glory, degraded by a mongrel mix of tradesmen and merchants. Really, it is too much. The very thought causes me pain. What can you possibly provide that will make your petition worth my effort? Hmm, what should I provide? Perhaps valuable information? Information? Unless you believe your source is better than agents of the Inquisition. Normally, I wouldn't trust your discretion. But the left hand of the Divine is working for you, is she not? Sister Leliana is a resourceful woman. I could certainly make use of her talents. Very well, Inquisitor. Should you fulfill this bargain, I shall... Raise the Duparakets into Lordship. Hmm. So I'm gonna use Lelan's help anyway. Hmm. I, I might as well have just used her agents in the first place, as she suggested. Uh, however, I decided to go the long way, and arguably the better way of going through all the bureaucracy to elevate these guys to nobility, and in the end I fall back to Lelan's favors. <laughs> but oh well. I received a letter from the House of Repose, Your Worship. They acknowledge their contract is null and void. There is no longer a price on my life. I'm glad you don't have to live your life looking over your shoulder anymore. I regret we were forced to deal with them. That you are endangered by my part in the game. Did I ever mention I used to be a bard? You were a singer. Bards entertain the Orlesian court. They sing, play music, make charming conversation, and spy. Many young nobles put on a mask and practice playing the game in such a fashion. So she was a bard too? What made you interested in becoming a bard? I was attending a university in Valroyo when I learned about bards. There was such an air of romance about them. Stories of secrets, trysts, and fascinating people. A group of us, young gentry from Antiva, decided this exciting life was for us. You seem a bit... steady for such an outgoing lifestyle. <laughs> the life of an entertainer didn't suit me at all. During one particular intrigue, I encountered the bard sent to kill my patron. We fought. Or perhaps scrapped is the better word. Both of us terrified. We were at the top of a steep flight of stairs. The other bald threw a knife, and I pushed him away from me. You can imagine the result. You were only defending yourself. But it was such a waste, Inquisitor. When I took off his mask, I knew him. We'd attended parties together. If I'd stopped to reason, if I'd used my voice instead of scuffling like a common thug, I'll always wonder who that young man would have grown into.
You of all people should know, you can't play the game without bloodshed. Never as the first resort, Inquisitor. Never as a way that makes currency of lives. In all the commotion... Uh, forgive me, I don't believe I ever thanked you for helping me with this. Hold on to it. Don't lose sight of why you came here. I will never forget you helped save the House of Montillier, Inquisitor. And should you ever visit Antiva, stories of the welcome we'll give you will be told for years. All right, so I guess no romance with her today. Or in this walk, Sire, at least. You should know those men approached me again. Okay. Hmm, I don't know. Maybe I will load up the safe at some point and try and romance her when I'm done with this. But we'll see. <laughs> 